Passing your Security Plus exam relies on two types of questions. The normal ones like the multiple choice ones and the PBQs, the performance based questions. Previously, I have published 100 different normal questions in my YouTube channel. Check them out. And now it's time to practice more PBQs. All right, let's jump right into it. Here is the question. You are reviewing different authentication methods for an organization's new access control system. Match the appropriate authentication factor to each description. So we have a couple of authentication factors and some descriptions. Each factor will be used only once. Now, these are going to be the factors that we have, like something you know, something you are, something you have, somewhere you are. And we have a couple of descriptions like these ones from A all the way up to D. So we're going to have to choose what authentication factor is appropriate for which one of these descriptions. Pause the video, go through them, read them, match them, and then we'll jump into the answers. All right, ready? A. To access your account, you scan your face using your phone's front camera. What that is, is something you are pretty much obvious. How about B? You swipe an access card to unlock the main office entrance. Which one that is going to be? Well, it's an access card that you have. Thus, it is something you have. All right. How about C? You must enter a security code that you memorize to log into the company portal. All right. That's pretty much obvious. It's something you know. The access code that you memorized is something that you know. And what about the last one? We only have one option, but let's go through it. Your system access is denied unless you are within the office premises. That's somewhere you are. You need to be within the office premises in order to access the system or portal or whatever that is. Now, this also can be kind of rephrased into having a VPN. So every single choice that we have in here can be rephrased into other things. Like for example, the A can be using your fingerprints. B can be using your, let's say, access badge to enter a data center. C can be used for the password of your email account and the we've already mentioned let's say having a VPN connection meaning that you are trying to replicate your physical presence by connecting to a VPN thus it's going to be the authentication factor of somewhere you are all right that's it for today I hope you enjoyed like the video subscribe for more because more about to come not only these questions, but also a crash course and a lot of good stuff in cybersecurity. I wish you success in your exam and catch you on the next one.